favor actor, get a heat. Favor drink or bowls, bears, hawks, socks, bowls. Say goodbye a little longer. Mike North Show every Sunday night at 9 o'clock right here. You can watch his daily 30 and 5 video commentaries at 560 WIND.com. This report brought to you in part by All Toff Industries, residential heating and cooling. You can call them today at 800 225 2443. Let's talk stem cell research. I'm a big fan. With Mike North this morning, really talking about Peyton Manning. Yeah. And apparently went to Europe to have some sort of stem cell surgery to try to repair a neck injury. And if that's true, that tells me that something went horrifically wrong here in the States. And if it is a career ending injury, somebody's on the hook for a lot of cash. Yes, Mike? I absolutely. Well, first of all, uh, uh, good morning to both of you guys. Second of all, stem cell research is uh, something that's been uh, controversial forever. But to br- go to Europe and to get it done after several surgeries, are, surgeries already, guys, uh, it looks like it's the end of the line for him. They're pulling out all the stops. And I got to be honest with you. I don't know how you guys feel about this. But when they start messing with your neck or your back at numerous times, yeah. I mean, you played 227 games in a row. Sandy Colfax got out when it was time. Maybe it's time he's going to try one more thing. But all the fame, all the glory, if something goes wrong with this, I mean, who knows what could happen? It's, it's got to be revolutionary if you got to go to another country to do it. That well, being said, there. he loves the game. He loves the game, and he wants to try one more thing. But this is a definite sign that his career may really be over because they gave him $90 million oh. over the last for a five-year deal. They just signed him this year. Now, are people going to tell you or me that they didn't know he had this problem? They knew he had a problem. He's entitled $26 million this year, <laughs> $20-some million next year. But it's like make good money. He's been so good for this franchise. They had no problem signing him because the reason they did that, guys, they had to get their season ticket money in. And if they tell everybody last year there's a chance he may not play this year you might see season tickets canceled you may see the tv ratings go down so they kept this charade going all the way to the end it go it's, it's sort of funny he was going to play the first game of the season now he's in europe getting stem cell well it sounds like from online that he's in so much pain that they mm-hmm. need the stem cell to regenerate that nerve area in his neck to give him relief because it's just debilitating pain right and you know what? And if that's the case, fine. But is it going to help him play the game of football? If it's there to, to ease his pain, fine. But this is a trouble sign. Even if it does ease his pain, Amy, will he ever be able to play the game again? I you mean, know, you've had several surgeries. Now you're going with uh-huh. stem cell. It does not sound good. And, uh, you know, they're in the Andrew Luck Derby right now, the number one quarterback out of Stanford. I mean, I hate to say it, but he's going to bank his money. The Mannings did not look happy last night when they were in New York. The, you know, you, can, you can't tell. I mean, his, their sons went in the game, and, and they look like uh, gloom and doom. So there's something more than meets the eye here. But this is really surprising news. Speaking really of uh, gloom and doom, is there any way that you would know as a medical expert here? Yes, sir. <laughs> Is there any way that uh, stem cell surgery could help our own Jay Cutler maybe smile a little bit? Well, here, you know what I find interesting, guys, and it, it's unbelievable to me. They keep, first of all, Matt Forte only carried the ball 10 times last week. He was, on, he was averaging five yards a carry. Now, they threw it to him 10 times for 117 yards, and he's 75% of the offense, yet they don't want to give him an extension. But then I'm driving down to Kennedy the other day, and you know Cutler's a mope. He really is. And, and you know, it, that's the only thing. I mean, it's a shame. <laughs> it's is. a shame he isn't a nicer he really guy. Is. He won't even stand with his team on the sidelines. Right. It's a yeah. shame that he's such a mope because you know what they tell me at Forte? Well, we're not ready to give you the money. You're making five hundred grand. Go when you drive down to Kennedy, all of our listeners on WIND. Drive down to Kennedy. See who's on the billboard today. It's Matt Forte. The guy makes about 550000 They say he's not, they're not going to give him an extension, yet they have him on the billboard. They'd already, they, he already paid for himself, so they better be careful because uh-huh. Cutler uh, is not, he's a public relations nightmare as far as the Chicago Bears are concerned. Well, Mike, thanks so much. We'll talk to you later this week. I hope to get a little preview of the Bears-Packers game. Oh, we'll yeah. And you know what? You. We are. Got a new name for the segment, John. I just came up with it. The last word on ba- on the Bears Sunday football. Well, before we have to get to our bookies, I'd love to g- do it. Exactly. Thank you, sir. <laughs> Thank you, Not that guys. I would ever bet illegally. I'm just, I do it for fun. News matter only. Exactly. <laughs> okay, Thank you. Bye-bye. For show prep only. Flood Brothers Disposal and a Recycling Services are professional waste haulers. Now, the Flood family is big on service. It's our number one priority, and we offer extremely competitive pricing because the Flood family is here to help you in this tough economy. Remember, at Flood Brothers, we build relationships. And the only thing we're big on is service. Call us at 773-626-5800 or floodbrothersdisposal.com.